Today I show you three tricks how to speed up your film sound editing when you got to move some clips and I bet you can use these tricks for a lot of other things. So here is a film sound mixing project and here is my music folder, my dialogue folder and here is my effects folder. And when you got at the dialogue track some things like footsteps or doors, I want to move them from dialogue to my effects folder into the production effects or fishing effects track. So let's say this clip here is not a dialogue, it's a door. It's very common to do this. I select this one, press the mouse, then command, scroll down, and you see it takes some time. Scroll down, scroll down, scroll down, and here is the production effects. So do this a few times and it's not very great. So the next way I go to this clip. Now I press P. You can see now the left locator is at the beginning of the clip and the right locator at the end. And when I press one, the right uh, numbers block. So here I'm at the beginning the end left locator right locator so now I cut this one this command X go here to the production effects command V insert and that's it but we can do this faster because I don't have to select this track I can stay here at the production effects and you still can use the mute button and the listen button and so on. You always stay with the selected track here. So when I go to another part, let's say here, do the same again. P, 1, X, command. And yeah, here it is. And now there is the third trick and it's the fastest one I created a macro so I go to here I activate my macro and it's done here it is and this one macro cuts this one you see it's not here the clip has been removed and sometimes you just want to copy this one so I press the other macro and nothing happened yeah this one has been copied so let's have a look at the macros and how they are working the first macro is called clip move copy at first i said transport location to selection next transport go to left locator so i'm at the right time position next edit copy and at last edit paste and the other macro is the same, but one thing differs. The third function is not edit copy, but edit cut. When this video helped you, please give me a thumb up. It would make me very happy. When you get some more questions or suggestions, just leave a comment and write me what are your macros that speed up your workflow. See you the next time. Bye.